Hi, we're two dads. I'm Rich. I'm Lou and we're with Claire and we're going to find out which types of finger foods we can introduce to our children around the age of six months. So when starting weaning at six months, what types of finger foods would you introduce first? So around the age of six months you can start to introduce your little one to finger foods because by then they're really good at starting to grip things and put them in their mouth and it's a really good way to help them learn to develop not just hand-eye coordination but gripping skills as well. So ideal finger foods at this stage would be vegetables that are reasonably soft cooked or soft fruit, anything that's quite sort of melty. So if you can squish it between your sort of finger and thumb, it's usually a good enough texture to be easily meltable within the mouth. So I've got some options here. Things that are sort of the size and shape of, of about your index finger. This is raw carrot, but you would want to cook this so it's soft enough to squish between your fingers or broccoli florets, so you would probably want to slice that in half maybe. But at this stage, that's the perfect sort of shape and size for your little one. They'll grab food sort of almost in the middle of their palm and sort of feed themselves like this. But it's great for developing chewing skills and their hand-eye coordination. Just go for something that's fairly soft and easy for them to grab. What would we want to be expecting them to achieve by by starting. The great thing about finger foods is that it puts them in control so they can tell you when they've had enough just by stopping eating. They're also learning about the different textures of foods, they're interacting with them. So when you are weaning, should you mix finger foods with purees and other foods or should you just stick to finger foods at first? It's really up to you. So if you want to go the baby led weaning route, then you would just offer foods as finger foods, almost like the foods that you would eat, but obviously avoiding anything that's high in salt or sugar and, and things like that. Um, and anything that's a really tricky texture that might be a choking risk. That's absolutely great and can really help little ones learn to manage their own appetite, learn to chew, learn the hand-eye coordination. It doesn't work for all babies, it might not be something that you want to do as parents, so it's absolutely fine to also offer finger foods alongside purees and, and mashed up foods. It's really up to you which way you want to choose. Yeah.